Despite the rain this morning at the finance ministry, the pensioners say they will not relent until their demands are met. And help us to resist the pressure through with all our will and mind forevermore. And help us to resist the pressure through with all our will and mind forevermore. But the deputy finance minister, Abnos Yassari, implored the pensioners to temporarily suspend their protests while government engages the Bank of Ghana to fulfill their obligations. I, I sincerely understand and appreciate where you are coming from. This has never happened where coupons are ready for payment or are due for payment and government has refused to pay. But currently we all know the circumstances in which we find ourselves and I'll plead with you let's sit and clear the five and then um, we'll see the way forward. So um, respectfully let's meet tomorrow um, discuss this and look at the long-term payment for the principal. We were, we were given the coupons that were outstanding that we needed to pay and then we are in talks with Bank of Ghana. Then I believe that from Monday you would see some payments being reflected. The convener of the pensioners, Dr. Edu Ananienchi, says the picketing will continue. Well, we are coming tomorrow for that one hour, but within that one hour we will meet with the ministry. They suggested that they will meet with us to decide on the payment of the principal. The first principal is 101 days in arrears now. Somebody's money that he's using for investment. You are keeping it. And we have said we will demand interest. Our plan is that we are meeting only on Thursdays and Friday. Every week we will give the government opportunity to pay what is due. The government is in arrears of four outstanding coupons and four outstanding principals to be paid to these pensioners with a fourth due today.